basically doing a huge Ulta and drugstore haul for all things summer nice keeping yourself moisturized smelling good looking good and yeah just all the things that I've accumulated this summer to have kind of like the best personal body care and just like in general so if you guys want to see all the things that I got from the drugstore and Ulta then just keep watching okay so I put it in like a little category the first category is just gonna be makeup because you need a whole new makeup thing for the summer it's it's just a necessity you can reuse some things but you need some other things so I got this cute Louis Vuitton makeup bag also over the summer she's really cute and you just open it like that you can zip it up and you can also just so you know that's a fun one so we got our Louis Vuitton and first thing in there that I love this one's new this is the Maybelline fit me foundation and people have been talking about this thing for years I remember when I first got into makeup people were talking about fit me and I used to try it when I was in like eighth grade and it's still an OG and I recently just came back to it and I got the dewy and smooth I'm not a huge fan I'm not really a matte girl so yeah and I got it in shade medium buff 225 and I mix this with my MAC like liquid foundation and it's really cute you can kind of make it like really thick or you can like kind of water it down with another like lighter foundation and my skin's looking good today so there we go and then the next makeup thing is the morphe spray this is an OG you need this for summer you're always sweating you want to look glowy like just literally just an OG I got the mini it came with a new sponge and powder so yes this is a necessity for summer makeup and then the next things are these two things from Essence. so i have tried essence before they honestly never turn me down one of my friends had one of these like volume boosters and i was like what i've never had a volume booster and i have like baby chode eyelashes so i needed it and then i got a new mascara i really liked the wand so i was like we gotta get this so i thought the wand was cool and it could really get into my really circular eyeballs because my eyes are kind of hard to like get in there so we got these they're really nice i've used them a couple times um the lash primer is good and i do notice the difference between using lash primer and not i'm not gonna use it every day but you know i tried it one time and i thought it'd be good so highly recommend those and those are both like two dollars each maybe maybe even cheaper i don't remember essence is amazing brand and then i got this milani baked bronzer literally amazing so i've actually had this one this one was not in the haul but i just threw it in there because y'all need this so i actually put this on top of my other blush that i got this is the morphe stick blush and she is so so good i've tried so many cream blushes i'm telling you i've tried so many you guys have no idea like i was a broke girl in college and i would only buy like the two dollar ones and i have finally cracked the code for affordable cream blushes i've never tried the expensive ones because i don't even want to go there and get addicted to a 40 dollar cream blush this one is probably the most expensive one i have this one was like eight dollars anywhere between like eight and twelve i can't remember and it's really cute i got it in hibiscus hottie so it just like goes like that and she is she is a killer y'all need this for sure and then that's when i go on with the milani baked blush bronzer thingy on top and then that's how you look like this cute okay. yeah she's cute um this one is in the shades rose dioro yeah so that is everything that i got in the makeup category and if y'all want to get this bag she's cute too we love her and then moving on into like the body care kind of things not like the soaps the new soaps and stuff but like the body care so heb was having an insane sale heb is like a drugstore in texas if y'all don't know comment below where y'all are from because i'm from texas and everything is heb so they were having 25% off basically all products. Like it was insane. I was really confused. So I got this cannabis sativa hemp seed oil sugar scrub. So if y'all, y'all bitches self tanning and doing all those things, you need a sugar scrub. And this one smells really good. Like it just smells like so clean. Like you're at a spa. Just smell it. <laughs> I wish y'all could smell it, but that means you have to go get it. Too bad I don't have like an affiliate code or anything. But yeah, it's like very good. Just amazing. Like Dr. Teal's is an amazing brand. If you're hurt, you can use this. If you just want to look good, it has shea butter and all those good things. Highly recommend this one. 
for like a natural remedy, not just smelling like dandelions and coconut. And then another cool thing that I got is for the nighttime. It is a Dr. Teal's spray. I always have trouble sleeping in the summer so i thought this would be good it smells so good it has melatonin and essential oils and i don't believe in taking melatonin anymore so why not spray it mm, it literally like if i could have a candle in this like mm. like i don't even know how to explain to you how good it's just like amazing sweet lavender without giving you like a headache and essential oils i don't even know so good and you're supposed to spray it at night you spray it like on a pillow and it's supposed to promote sleep you can use it in the shower on the pillow in the bedroom and on your body on your body i didn't read that well now i'm gonna smell like heaven but i really want to like i want my room to like smell like this when i come in so that's why i want to like start like associating sleeping with the smell i feel like that'll be good i don't want to just wear it all the time and then the last thing is a self tanner so i love self tanner but I also hate self-tanner. Self-tanner is a beast and it's hard and you get streaky and you look weird and it's a lot because you have to scrub yourself. So I got tan, tan a lot, just self-tan water and shade medium. So I've gotten, obviously the Tan Lux is a com competition and like a better brand, but this one was significantly cheaper, like one fourth of the price. I think this was $14 and I heard it's really, really good and it has like a little spray. So you can just spray it and rub it. And since it's a water, it like uh, builds up over time. It's not like just like a mousse that's gonna streak everywhere. But it also can be a little tricky because you can't see it, but it doesn't leave as crazy of these streaks like everything else does. So I would try it. I would start off with a tanning water for the summer. And sometimes my face is darker than my body or my body is darker than my face or I white everywhere, dark everywhere, peeling everywhere. So you can just kind of like squirt this wherever and get a good little building up your tan. So I recommend that one. And then moving on to like the bathroom only, like soaps and like fun things like that that I got. So the first fun one is this Dove Body Wash Mousse, but it also acts as shaving cream. So I was like, what? No way. And it's made with coconut oil. And like, look at that spout, like it's so cool. So I'm just gonna spray it on since it's, look at that guys, did y'all see that? That was crazy, that was crazy. So, so look at that, like, what? I probably made it's body wash. It's not moisturizer, so I need to go wash myself. But it smells so like you know how like some coconut things are like so sweet and kind of like intolerable. This is like, mmm, like ah. Uh, it's just so good. It smells like coconut oil mixed with just like beautiful soaps in a flower, not even a flower, like a cotton fresh laundry field with a little sweetness of coconuts. I would love to smell like this. Good thing I got it. Y'all need to get it. It's literally just body wash mousse made with coconut oil. This might be like the standard flavor. I think it's new. Oh yeah, it says new. And then this is the OG. I've discovered this last summer. This bitch will make you smell like coconut have caressed your body and taken over the planet. Literally so good. If you want to smell like a beautiful coconut, sweet, luxurious, and nice while being like really clean, this is amazing. I actually discovered this on a trip. My friend and I just randomly bought this because I love coconut. It is my favorite smell and I like look forward to washing myself in this scent. Like I look forward to like getting out of the shower and it lingering on me. Like I almost want to just like leave it on whenever I get out of the shower because it smells so good. If you like any type of like clean sweet smell like it is it's a lot sweeter than this but like it's better than this this one is better y'all need this but this one is cool because it has like the little squirty thing but yeah i finally upgraded to the big boy with the pump so yeah y'all need this in your life i'm not kidding this was on sale for like eight dollars how can i not get it y'all need that you need it go get it now all right next up is my face wash so i discovered this a while back and it's very light and i have very acne prone skin and i'm pretty sure my skin looks pretty fire right now so for someone with acne not too bad if i do say so myself so this is beauty bio and it's in the balance so this balance is your ph it's a cleanser it has ginger root and oat kernel extract it's very cute it's very aesthetic that's not what i got it i did not even know what it looked like when i tried it so there's that and i have been using it for like six months now and my skin has literally transformed since i used it and i never say that this is the like the first time something has finally worked for me and it's like 30 bucks it's the first time i've ever bought a 30 dollars cleanser and stuck with it because it's the only one that's ever worked next up is pimple patches Pimple patches are changing the game. They come in cute aluminum, tin, tin, aluminum tins. And they're basically like bandages for your pimples. 
and they're clear you can put your makeup over them you can hide your pimple and i also like reduce the redness of your pimple because it's like a clear patch of your skin so if you haven't had them i'm sure everyone watching this has knows what a pimple patch is but i just get the circle ones and these are bomb the brand is welly i got these from like the, the uh, medicine section so they're like actually good for you they're not just like random ass patches with nothing on them they like really protect your skin so i'm a cute in portable Ugh. Okay, and the last two things are the Aveeno hair, uh, they're new. So I got the Blackberry Quinoa Protein Blend, and these are color protectant and they strengthen. So I've always used Pantene and I wanted to try something new. And I really recommend these, they're very moisturizing, they smell good, and they linger in your hair like the smell without like giving you like a headache, if that makes sense. Like a lot of things give you like a headache if the smell lingers. But I thought these were extremely nice. Good, they're made with oats, they're just good, I guess. Simple ingredients from simpler times, they say. Oh, it's good for you. I already know. So yeah, I would highly recommend these as well. It's the first ingredient in scalp soothing, farm fresh inspired blend with a blackberry and quinoa protein and it prevent breakage and color fade. So my color always fades because I am fake. <laughs> This is my real like hair color, but I still have like this much blonde from like two years ago. Okay, maybe not that much, but at least blonde from here. So like it's still in my hair, I think. I don't know, my hair just always gets lighter and I want to maintain the color until I fully get my real hair back. So I have breakage and color problems. So here we go. Anyone who wants to keep their color in, I would try these if, unless you want to use like your purple shampoos and your dyes, then you go do that. But if you want just like a basic thing, this one was pretty good and they were like seven, eight dollars each. So not too bad. And they smell good, like I was saying. All right, guys, so that is everything for this video. I hope you guys loved it and you're gonna go buy a lot of new coconut things. Go do it. I promise you will not regret it. And thanks so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm really trying to grow my channel and I need you guys to comment, like, share, whatever, and get me boosted, please. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao. Thank you.